Understanding another language is always a huge bonus in life. It helps you explore a different culture, learn about its food, and find out where the bathroom is. Well, now there's a translator that can assist you with all of the above. Just know that the bathroom is uh, usually a fire hydrant. If only dogs could talk. That's the sentiment behind innovator Vincent Kim's idea to create a smart dog collar that can distinguish your dog's emotional states. It all started with his own dog in college and the deep desire to want to understand his pup better. I spoke to Mr. Kim and his colleague Andrew Gill about their pet pulse invention from Seoul, South Korea. Hello, Vincent and Andrew. Hello, Mo. Hi, Mo. After you got the idea in college, what motivated you to develop the smart dog collar? Early in my career in the pet industry, I saw that very few people were interested in understanding dogs. I had the idea of analyzing dogs' voices through their bark, but no one took it seriously. I was frustrated at first, but I eventually decided to pursue the idea. Vincent and Andrew worked in tandem alongside Seoul National University to develop tech that could separate a dog bark from other sounds like a human's voice and also analyze each bark. Your device can determine a dog's emotion? It can determine five different emotional states. Happy, relaxed, and anxious, and angry, or sad. And also it attracts a dog's rest and activity for the complete view of their wellness. The voice recognition system uses a bark's pitch, tone, volume, and frequencies to determine each emotion. For example, an angry emotion tends to be loud or with little space between barks. Breed, age, size, and other variables are all taken into account in determining these emotional states. So how do you keep track of your dog's emotions? A uh, Pepper's device detects uh, dog's bark sound, record them, and then send them to our main server. Dog's bark sound will be analyzed and delivered to the Pepper's app in the owner's cell phone in real time. Well, it's been a treat having you on our show. Thank you, Mo. Thank you.